Greetings all, Frog here, Let's Play City Skylines, where we are here in the land of eternal night, so it seems. Um, so, what are we going to do today? Today we are going to finish, uh, well not finish, probably, but do more work on our downtown area. This is supposed to be the downtown, so we'll add some parks in between uh, and some more places. Um, but I, I'm going to talk about uh, a little how the plans are. So once we get the light, remind me, and, uh, and I'll play. But look at, look at this, this is looking good, man. Going good. There's a giant, giant office complex. I mean, you're what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Probably like ten stories before you even get to the thing. So that's like it's a hundred-story building. But everybody's got to have their one little like giant building, right? Okay. Um, we're gonna let the simulation run because I would like it to be daylight. I don't know why it's not yet daylight, but it's not. But we could start thinking about parkland. I like this one. This one turned out pretty nice. With the castle in it. That was last week's episode. If you missed that, go ahead and check that out. I want to see that being built. And some more parkland somewhere. Oh, that's right. Every game, every episode, every game we have to do this. I don't know why it just doesn't remember that. I always want that at a hundred. Alrighty. We don't have any cargo trains yet. This is all just purely our regional rail network. It actually doesn't even connect into the main rail. This literally is just a regional rail network. So we will want to connect into our main rail at some point. Um, yeah, I don't like you. We're going to have to turn you off at some point. I don't know why it's dark. Oh, is that sunlight on the horizon? I keep wanting it to be sunlight. I don't think it is. I don't know which way is east. So I don't know where to look for it. How's that roundabout done? Doesn't look real good. I want to kind of redo that. Oh, that looks ugly too. I want to redo that. Ugh. Look at all these trucks. Commercial harboring up. Where are you, Mr. Weir Mr. Hot Dog Van? Going to now new commercial center. All right, thanks, Mr. Hot Dog Man. We'll get rail out there at some point to the industrial rail. Where is the rail network? Here somewhere. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. So rail comes through here. We'll bring it down. I would really love it to be light out. Okay, we haven't actually built anything yet. Let's uh, let's go with this block here. Oh, it's getting lighter. It's getting lighter. It's definitely getting lighter. All right, let's pause the simulation for a second. Where is the sun rising? The sun rising is over there. That's the east. I've been orienting this map with this is north the entire time. This is north. My mind just like blew up a little bit in my head. That's honestly kind of mind blowing. South it is. Right. Let the sim run again. Put in our light poles. Go away, please. Thank you. Pretty sure I'm gonna need at least one in the middle of the long sections. So that'll be that part. Mm -hmm. 
love these pieces. No, we need is like a bandstand. Is there a bandstand in there? I don't have a new stand. Got a fast food grill? Just random fast food along the path. Fast food down the light. We also have a waistband. Spins on that. Slice spin in this one. Yes, it is. A very environmentally conscious city. How's it doing? It's doing okay. Need more education. Let's check how that is going on. We could use some oil elementary schools. Another one on this side of the town. And it takes us up to uh, 700. We're going to need one more, so we'll put one over on this corner too, because it's the only one without one. Alright, so it gets all those in. How's the high school doing? High school's fine. University is probably plenty good, yep. Yeah. It will become more of a problem as we get on. Police is still good. I mean, it's a very small area, really. So it's not like we have a huge crime rate going on. We just have the one precinct. That, and that's not a precinct, that's the headquarters, right? Yeah, so we gotta get some precincts out here. So let's, let's, put, let's build some city service areas, really. There's no, there's no budget limit, so why wouldn't we want to make sure people are safe? I think that's the best way, really. Fire, um, again, mostly people are safe, but we'll just do up little civic areas. So there's always place to, places to go. Um, and the fire headquarters downtown, sure. Medical, medical's tougher. It's just not very well distributed. Yeah, because, I mean, it's there, there, and there. We could use one on this side of town. We'll slide one in here somewhere. Maybe, no. Slide one in right there. That'll work well. Uh, cemeteries. One in each corner, basically, so that's fine. Crematoriums. One, two, three, four. One in each quadrant, so that's fine. Garbage. Seems to be fine. Our industry has taken off up there, so that's good. Um, and Metro Lines, is there a stop at the school? Look at that, there's a stop at the school. It's like I planned it. That's gross. That's gross. Okay, now that it's daylight, let's talk. I'll pause the sim for a second. Let's talk planning. So this is gonna be our big developed downtown urban area, right? We're gonna have high rises, all this tall, tall community. Anything that's zoned small, I think I'm going to go back and kill, except for this, because this, this makes sense to be like, these are the like people that were there first, so they've got their small little houses still, but anything else is going to be tall. Then, excuse me, we're going to have a natural forest kind of like right here. We might put one of these avenues to come through, but for the most part, we'll call this a natural forest. We'll put some parks, trees, that kind of thing, but then the roads will come through. This will be suburbia. Suburbia comes out here, suburbia comes out over here, but up here, we'll bring the train in. Bring the train down. I think we'll bring the train down here, through here, and connect it in. Then on this side of the loop, we'll go out towards here, I think, and then come back in, to, well, I guess in over here. Go through that mountain probably as a tunnel. The other thing that I'm going to do is up here in this area, we're going to make this kind of farmland. We'll do forestry through here. Oh, this is cool. What's down here? This little rock climb. Um, we'll do forestry here, but then we're going to plan out, like, farms that are all in this sort of area. So, like, this will be the far outside industrial, but then just farmland. All this stuff will be farms. Farm, farm, farms. So, suburbia, farms, and probably actually some farms down in here. 
And then we'll do, along the coast, we'll do our, our beach areas. I'm not going to do that for a while because I want to get some good um, assets to put in there. And uh, we don't have those yet. So for now, let's let's take a look at this park. That park, that park is, is a good start, but let's keep going. Uh, we'll let the sim run in the background. Let the places get big. So we got a little burger joint in the middle of the park, which is cool. Got a little tourist information kiosk here. I'm gonna make this kind of a like a tourist stop. Bring their bikes. I mean, like a real place. They won't line up. That will have plenty of bikes. Okay. This fountain right in the middle. And then since there's food here, there should be places to eat. There's places to eat. Get some more benches along the way. Some people just want to sit in and chat. Some people want to sit underneath the, uh, the trees. I may never even remember those are there. But I think that's awesome. They're there if you want them. Just kind of walk right through there and back, boom, you're in. Yeah, there's really no big pathway from the outside. Just kind of, you can, you can go around. You can see where you're going. I'm not going to put any dog or kid things in here. And paths and the trees. Some good shade trees. People will want to be in there. Kind of doing this border because this is like the um what's oh, raining this is like the food area there's like a little border to kind of prevent you from just walking through it a little more private cool I'm digging it man some more trees over here One of these bad boys. It's pretty good. Alright, this is along the street. Is that not zoned? It's not. I left it unzoned. Cool. Loving this thunderstorm. Very cool. What's in this park, huh? Oh, oh wow, well, that's huge. Oh, army 
the bunker, isn't it? Yeah. It's the old army bunker. Our citizens demand lights. Wow, it's really coming down. I don't think this one needs a lot of stuff done to it. Attractive City Award. Fantastic. Alright. Come up come up above. Do a quick check on our things. By the way, Auto Bulldoze Mod, phenomenal. I just want to say that. Education, universities are fine, obviously. Elementary, we need more elementary schools. This is unrealistic. Um, as we know. It's completely unrealistic. You don't need this many schools. Not elementary school. Well, maybe. For 80,000 people in my town, we have 15 elementary schools? Yeah, okay. How many people do we have right now? 15,000? I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 already. That's a little unrealistic. Those two are already right there. It's crazy. You think we need more in this area? The two of them right next door to each other. That's what I'm about to do right there. It's ridiculous. One next to a cemetery. Teach kids about death. All right, that's fine. High school. We need another high school. Okay, we'll put our high school by the train yard so kids can easily walk to school. After they take the train. I do like the thought of it going against both roads. That's pretty cool. Alright, so 5,000 capacity for that. That's fine. And we have more than enough of that. Okay. Education's good. Cops. Cops are fine for now. Fire. We really should put a, an outreach station out here. Just in case something goes south. I'm going to say, you better turn color. You're sitting right there. Medical is fine. Garbage collection is mostly fine. Put an incinerator at the end of the block. We should put incinerators down by the power. We have some incineration capability if we really want to. Hopefully, I don't need water. I don't know, honestly. They do. Plenty of water available. What do I do? Three pumps each? 
Yeah, three of the big treatment plants, and then three water pumps. We have 360,000 a week. We can train 480,000. We're well good. We're proper good. Electricity, of course, is electricity. We've got plenty available. 462 megawatts right now. It's a little cloudy. Otherwise, we're good to go. It's dark out again. Which is good. How to do with those parks? That lighting looks good. Natural, not too not too lit. Yeah, that's good. I'm loving it. Well, guys, I think this is what this is going to be like. My my whole goal with this series going forward, the more I think about it, is I'm going to uh, kind of take a Bob Ross approach to it and just uh, see what we need. Add the little happy trees when we need them. Take out the ones when we don't. You know, I'm, I mean, what did I do this episode? Basically, did two parks. Made sure we had plenty of education and city services, and I think that's what, it, what it's going to be. You know, if we let, if the simulation runs, we'll keep track of city services, and if it doesn't, we'll focus more on some design issues and, and go from there. So we're going to focus on the downtown for a little bit longer, but we will eventually move out to the suburban areas as well. So keep an eye on the playlist if you don't want to watch every episode. Just look for the titles, and you'll, you'll hopefully see exactly where we're going. For now that we're out of time, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, click the like button. Consider subscribing to the channel to stay updated to everything that happens. And until next time, cheers.